a plus b times open parentheses c plus d is equal to a plus bc plus bd represents which of the following properties? So to get from the left-hand side to the right-hand side, it looks like what they did is they multiplied the b times the c plus d. In fact, they distributed the b. b times c plus d is b times c plus b times d. So this is clearly the distributive property. Let's do another one. 4 plus, open parentheses, 10 plus 6, they're saying is the same thing as 4 plus 10 first plus 6. So on the left-hand side, we're doing the 10 plus 6 first, and then we're adding the 4. On the right-hand side, we're adding the 4 plus 10 first, and then we're adding the 6. And we're saying it's, they're equal to each other. It doesn't matter how we associate these numbers. Here we're associating the 10 and the 6 first, and then we're adding the 4. Here we're associating the 4 and the 10 first, and then we're adding the 6. So this is the associative property for addition. Associative. Let's do several more. A plus B is equal to B plus A represents which of the following properties. So it doesn't matter which order I'm adding. It doesn't matter if I do A plus B or B plus A. This is the commutative property. Let's do another one. Which one of the equations on the right represents the associative property of addition? So remember, associative property, we're talking about it doesn't matter how we associate the numbers. So if we, we might do the operation on two of the numbers first and then on the third, or on, or, or on maybe two of the other numbers and then on the, the one that's left over. So let's see what over here looks like that. So this right over here, this is the commutative property. This right over here is the distributive property. This one right over here, on the, le on the left hand side, we add b plus c first. On the right hand side, we add a plus b first. And these two things are equal to each other. It doesn't matter how we associated, if we associate b plus c first or a plus b first. So this is the associative property of addition. Let's do which of the following, which, of, which one of the equations on the right represents the distributive property of addition over multiplication? So let's see, where this first one, they're just changing the associations. Here, this is commutative, this last one. Here, they're actually distributing the b over the c plus d. So b times c plus d is the same thing as bc plus bd. So it's that one right over there. Maybe do a few more of this. This is a lot of fun. a plus b plus c is equal to a plus b plus c. So this, once again, they are reassociating the numbers, but it doesn't matter which order we associate them in. So this is the associative. This is the associative property. Which one of the equations on the right represents the commutative property of addition? So commutative, we don't care about the order in which we're doing the operation. So a plus b is equal to b plus a. Which one of the equations on the right represents the commutative property of addition? Well, that's what they just asked us. a plus b is equal to b plus a. And we are done.